Hey everyone, I'm back with a share video. Um, I just wanted to show you a few things that um, I've done and a couple of cards that I've received. And um, so, I, let's see. Let me move my. Here we go. I got this cute card from Paige. Isn't this cute? <laughs> she said it was a spring Easter card. So, um, little Easter spring card, yeah. And she wrote me a sweet little note. And, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, it opens like this. It opens like this. It opens like this. It's so cute. I love the pink page. Love pink. And the cute little bunnies. Egg hunt in progress. You know, these, um, this has got sparkles on it. I don't know if she put them on there or if the paper came that way, but it's so cute. And then it's got the, um, checkered pattern on the inside. Love these papers, Paige. And along with this, she sent some... <laughs> jelly beans which were eaten right when I opened the card <laughs> right after I opened the card oh, I couldn't resist them thank you Paige for the goodies and also she sent me some doilies and I think these are stamping up doilies um, they're ivory on one side and white on the other yeah, I've been wanting some of these so thank you so much Paige and I can incorporate them into a project Love it, love it. Thanks so much for thinking of me. And then I also got a card from my sweet friend, Jill. She's all the time thinking of me, and I really appreciate your cards, Jill. Um, I'm sorry if I haven't gotten on Facebook, I mean, excuse me, YouTube, <laughs> and thanked you, but I, I really do appreciate your cards. It says, enjoy <clears throat> the little things in life. Life is too short to be anything but happy. And she just said she wanted to say hello and hope all is well. So thank you, Jill. We're doing okay. Hanging in there. I hope you are doing good. And uh, and I, once again, I do appreciate your card. The cards <clears throat> you have sent. Thanks so much. Then I've been working on some little projects. My daughter uh, has a friend at work who her dad has uh, had heart surgery, and she wanted a little get well card. I made some get well cards, and she took she took what she wanted, so it's gone. But um, <clears throat> she also took one of these that I made, and this is the cutest little thing. It's a little bed. <laughs> That the cutest thing and I put some little feet on it and um, this opens up it's a box so you can put goodies in it and um, it says get well soon and the pillows I made them out of uh, cosmetic sponge uh, they're supposed to really be candy and I didn't have any candy but um, paper crafter 45 is where I got this idea and she put um, the Hershey Nuggets in this for the big pillows and a Tootsie Roll right here for the round, the roll pillow. And then she stuck the little, um, you know, the wrapper, stuck it outside in, in, uh, with the twist part and made it look like one of those elegant little um, roll pillows that you put on your bed. So I just, I thought this was so adorable. And um, I thought I'd share that with you. And if you want to make one for someone, um, check out Paper Crafter 45. And uh, she is just very talented and makes a lot of different things. And I've been making some of these uh, photo, I guess you call them folios or just a little album, mini album. And I got this idea from uh, May May Made It. And um, 
And I just love these little things. I think they'll be really great for gifts. But this one uh, opens up like this. And there's a flap here. It says so stinking cute. Flap here. And a flap here that says snapshot. And a little camera. Smiley face. Then these fold down. <coughs> Excuse me. And I purchased the... Uh, stamp set from May May to uh, do the stamps here. Place photo here. This is a little pocket. It says worth a thousand words. And then this one falls down. And you turn it around and it's like this on the back. And you can put photos here also. And small photos on the little tabs if you wanted to. But I just think these things are so cute. And they're not hard to make once you understand how to do all the cutting. You know, and that one says place photo here, journey. And you can pick which one you want to be the front. I chose this one, Happy Together. But you could flop this one over and let it be the front, and it says Journey. So it's what, whatever you want. But um, I've made three of these, and they're each one's different. Um, I put a big white bow on this one. And this one says Making Memories. A great day and these this says live every day bliss smile and you can decorate them any way you want to um, this one's not not like the other one exactly so uh, it's whatever you want to do say cheese strike a pose and then this, this is the pocket again I can get <laughs> there we go picture perfect and got stuck for some reason and then just flip it over and then you have the same thing you know similar on the back I don't know if this is showing up the right color it's navy blue and white let me turn that light on see if that helps make your memories So that's that one. And then the pink one. <coughs> Excuse me. And so this one falls out. It says place photo here. It says smile. So stinking cute and making memories. Now that's upside down because it goes to the back, to the other side. So that one says live every day. Strike a pose. And bliss. And these fold down. It says place photo here. Place photo here. And of course when you put your photo there, that's going to cover that up. <clears throat> and then here's the front she calls this one this side the front so making memories so stinking cute smile and then I'm losing it good times and I did this one different I just did the stamp place photo here and then I did this one with a and put a great day there so that one's that one in fact you know what I think this is in in reverse but it doesn't really matter I mean you know <laughs> okay that's them little uh, mini album and I 
I guess you may remember me making these before. Um, my aunt um, is a great grandmother now, which makes her daughter <laughs> a grandmother. So I made this. I'm not sure which one I'm going to give it to yet. But um, that's the baby's initials, Simone Charlotte. And I um, just think it's so cute. And you open it up. And there's a place for pictures and journaling. I decorated the back there. I put some rickrack on this one and added stickles. If you can see that. Bring my light over here. I'm afraid everything's going to fall off my desk. Let's see if that helps. And then this one. And it has something on the back. And a little baby carriage. So cute. This is actually the center of it. Of the album. This has date, weight, height. It's a girl. And then on this one you have this little pocket where um, if you want to put a different picture in here, you can. And why it's not cooperating, I don't know. Okay, and then you flip it over like that. Have another place for a picture and journaling. Or another picture. It's just what she wants to do. And there's some cute little stickers. And here's the back of this one. And I put some little pins right there. These don't want to do too well because it's a tight fit. you got to get them just right. Okay, and then this one's just like the other one, except the back is different. And then you flip it. Let's see, did I? Yeah, I did them. And I did them. Okay. And you flip it open. Real pretty paper. And there's the back. It's just little sweet pea. And I put these uh, little sequins down here. Sweet little baby. This flips this way. And cute little bear. things on the back. It says playtime. And it's got the little ABCs down there. Sweet baby. And cute little shoes and hearts. And the word baby. It's so pretty. Okay. And we'll go back to the center. And this is the back. Put lace on the bottom. Bought these little buttons at uh, Michael's. You can just cut off the shank on the back of them and uh, use them. Probably got this at Michael's too. I'm not really sure. And these hearts, they may have been gifted to me. I'm not sure. The roses. But that's my little mini album. So I thought I'd share that with you. I used a doily on the front. And uh, it blended in. 
so there you go hope you enjoyed it hope you enjoyed seeing my projects um, if you have any questions just feel free to uh, ask um, Lakeland Avenue designs I believe is where I got this she doesn't do videos anymore I don't know why because she's really talented but um, Marla is her name and um, I got this idea from her so check her videos out she's got some good ones on YouTube okay so that's it and I think I told you May May made it it's where I got this idea so I'm hoping to make some more of these these are really nice and uh, they feel good in your hand they're substantial you know they they've just got a good feel to them like they would hold up so um, if you want to make these you can go to May May's May May made it crafts is her name on YouTube and uh, then paper craft 45 for the little bed and I just think this is a great idea for someone who is uh, has been in the hospital or not feeling well um, it's, I think it's just a great idea so um, thank you for watching and again thanks to my newest subscribers that have joined me and thanks to my older ones and appreciate you watching and um, please comment and like it if you like it and um, I would love to have a giveaway again so um, let me think for the this um, drawing you will have to watch my previous video and tell me which card you would like to receive in the mail of the five um, birthday cards that I made. Which one would you like to receive in the mail? And um, you tell me when your birthday is and you'll get it. And also I'll have a surprise um, to send to you also. So I appreciate y'all and thank you for watching. God bless you. Happy Easter. He is risen. Thank you all. Bye now.